like this feeling right now is like the rest of Thursday is going to be such an amazing day because I just know that I did so much work. Okay, my name's Eva Clark. I started Hura in 2010 back in Australia, so I've been doing it for almost nine, well, nine years. So for the first couple of rounds, you don't want to rest. Okay, so I'm gonna work you. We have to plug a bit more. Okay, work you hard, and then as we move in. Yeah, so I would say that Hura is, it's about finding your limits. So it's um, whatever, whatever category of exercise that you think of, try to, try to think of mashing everything together. So if you've got a bit of CrossFit, a bit of boot camp, a bit of Les Mills hit, high intensity interval training. So I kind of mash it all together and I kind of go by basically, you know, how the group is feeling, um, you know, how far I can push them. And every individual within the, the class, you know, they're at different levels. So I try to um, compensate, you know, their ability to what we're doing. So no one's kind of struggling. So we scale the exercises to suit their ability and it's for everybody. I do hua because it's a good way to get in a mix of both strength and cardio exercise. I think it's also an effective way of just releasing stress, you know, forgetting about this academic life that I have and focusing on myself and my own abilities. Um, it's just a good way to challenge myself, uh, set goals and beat them, set new ones. Are you clear? Are you next? I think one time we were doing a workout on Thursday and I was slacking off and I just didn't really, I wasn't there. And I was waiting to just go home and we were doing like bench presses and at one point Ava singled me out and just like held me there. So everyone else was done and she's like, you're gonna do like another three minutes. Cause she was watching me and she's like always on me and like, like making sure that if I was gonna do the workout, I'd do it right. So I never forgot that moment. She pushed me farther than I thought I could. I think because in Hua you, you're pushing yourself and you're inspiring others to push themselves as well, as well, you kind of form a bond that transcends just the class. Uh, we talk out of class, we work out outside of class hours, we work out on the weekends, we hang out on the weekends, and so it's not just a workout class, but it's a fitness community that I never thought would, I would have become a part of. The Hua, Hua community is just a diverse bunch of individuals that want to be challenged. So basically, you know, I've got um, people that, you know, I, I, I couldn't see myself when I was a younger child, younger person hanging out with because they were too smart for me. But here I am, you know, uh, cracking the whip and guiding them along in something that I'm passionate about. So, you know, that's what I mean. It's like you don't have to be the fittest. You don't have to be the smartest. You just have to come to the group and want to challenge yourself. So, you know, the community is just, you know, a tough tough bunch of people that want to do their best in that that hour of opportunity they they give themselves to work out every day so it's it's really good